Joe Biden has been a phenomenal president. He's lived up to so many of the promises he's made. There's one promise left that he could fulfill, being a transitional figure. He could resign the presidency in the next 30 days, make Kamala Harris the president of the United States. Whoa. He would absolve her wow. <laughs> from being able to, ha to, from having to oversee the January 6th transition, right, of, of, her, of her own defeat. All right, y'all already know, man. So what you just heard was former aide to Kamala Harris, Jamal uh, Simmons, pretty much said on CNN that there's still hope and that Kamala can get a victory, a symbolic trinket victory, by having Joe Biden step down for two months just so we can have a first woman president. I thought it was, I, I thought he was joking, but I'm seeing a lot of people on social media talking about it, and I don't understand the point. I, if this was a, this is America, right? This is supposed to be a democracy, but you want to force Joe Biden out of office early? You already forced the man from rerunning the election the democrat party already turned on him but now you want kamala harris to be president for two months and what does that get what will that do for the american people what a a, a token a trinket this is why one of the reasons why she didn't win the election because people are tired of shiny objects we want changes we want things that's going to actually be attainable in our communities but no people are still holding on hope now kamala is what 60 ish she still can re can rerun can rerun in 2028 and she still will be young on the scale of being a president and you never know what could change by then as far as the world or our country whatever but to sit here and and the democrat party have completely changed honestly they used to be the working class and they have became the bourgeoisie and what <laughs> what world do you say you know what she lost but joe do it joe we did it joe please joe just step aside. You already had to step aside from running another four years, which I think most Americans, you know, agreed he should have done. But not only did you bully him into that, but now you want to bully him into stepping down to have a trinket for two months, even though she can't, she can't really be able to do nothing, implement nothing, fail to forget that that will show other worlds, other worlds, other countries, how unstable our country is. Y'all rather do all of that for a trinket just to say you had a woman president for less than 60 days, you know, so it don't make any sense to me. Um, I don't I don't I don't I don't get it, but this is the problem with the Democratic Party. And, and let me say this as well. And I know this is not going to be a lot of people not going to like this, but it, we got to talk about stuff like this. Let's say she does get in office right for two months. What, 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 what does that do for our people, for black people? Does that lift us up and give us something that we can look forward to and to give us hope to say, you know what, we had a woman president, but she lost, but then Joe did the right thing and, and now look at her or it doesn't it, it make us more of a laughing stock of people, you know. The fact that people are still whining about this. The election was a week ago. We should have unity by this point. It's time to move on. But you having people online trying to campaign Joe to do the right thing. Step down and let her be in office. We did it, Joe. <laughs> I just want to get my quick thoughts about it, man. I want y'all to be honest. I mean, as long as I ain't disrespectful, you can give your honest opinion about it. But tell me what y'all think.